So Wayne, a little bit of a disappointing day at the office this afternoon um, from a team that have been doing well, particularly away from home. Uh, what's your thoughts on the uh, the result and the performance today? Uh, result absolutely fair. Um, three thoughts were better than us today. Um, we've never really got going at all first half. Um, the goals that we conceded are really poor. Um, and yeah, uh, very, very frustrating. Um, and at 3 0 at half time, the game's probably over. All you can do is try and um, get a bit of pride back, really, and try and get some positives for the game on Tuesday. Um, I think we did that a little bit to a degree, but um, there, there, were, there were more efforts second now for sure. Um, still lack the quality, still didn't create any, uh, anywhere near enough chances, to, um, considering with the home team. Um, but listen, I, I don't want to take anything away from Cleethorpe today. I thought they were good. Um, giving a massive helping hand by us um, in, in terms of the goals that we conceded. Um, and their shapes caused us a little bit of problems, which it, it, it shouldn't have caused us so many problems. Um, so we need to obviously reflect on that. But um, listen, there's always going to be bumps in the road. I don't mind getting beat um, if if we've given everything that we can. I don't think we can look in the mirror today and, and, and those lads can say that they've given everything today. Um, you know, I think we've carried um, quite a few passengers and um, there'll definitely be changes for Tuesday. Uh, I think we need to freshen things up. Um, I think we need to understand that um, we've achieved nothing. It's a good start, granted. Um, but um, you know we don't don't need to be, believe in any hype or, or, or thinking that we're the um, the best thing since sliced bread because we're not. We're going to have to work, work hard and we're going to have to win every single victory. Um, and I think we were outworked and I think we were out for and um, and I just think that they, that they were clearly with them, they were better than us today. Okay, you changed the formation at half time, going for more of a three at the back and a three five two or a three four one two. What were your thoughts behind that at half time? Just to, just just to try and. Um, somehow get a foothold in the game and, and try and get back in, in, in the match. Um, I, you know, obviously, like I said, you know, I think at three 0 it's very, very unlikely that you're going to come back and get anything out of the game. But, um, but what I asked was for a reaction, and what I asked for was pride, uh, get a bit of pride back out of the game. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure we fully did that, but certainly it would have better. It, it would have better second half. I think deck coming on obviously gives us a bit more organisation organization defensively. I could have, I could have took, I could have took any of the first, the, the, the starting eleven off at, at half time. So Prince and Tabish can, can can consider themselves a little bit unlucky, but um, it was just to change the shape and just to try and um, get some kind of um, foothold in a game where we'd been very much second best for forty five minutes. Okay, looking ahead then finally to Tuesday, we're away to workshop in the wonderful county of Nottinghamshire. Uh, knew you'd get a laugh out of that. Um, no Harry Gagin today. Um, obviously, Ross Killick's out long term. Is, is anybody picked up any knocks or are we looking at a near enough clean bill of health for Tuesday? Uh, we'll have to assess our game. Obviously, he's come, off, he's come off very early in the game. He's been carrying a little bit of a problem with his ankle for a couple of weeks, but been managing it quite well. Um, you know, he's a big player for us. Um, you know, he does a lot of the nasty, horrible things that don't get seen and appreciated by um, by most football fans. But he's certainly appreciate, appreciated by by himself and Chick, and um, he's appreciated by his teammates. But um, no, no, Archie's Archie's more than more than capable, I and mean, actually had a real good start to the season before his um, ankle problem. But yeah, we, we've got one or two knocks, but nothing nothing major. We've got a reasonably clean bill of health. Um, there's no reason to. Um, start to worry or to panic. We've got good numbers. The, the, the key now is the reaction. Um, very, very tough game on Tuesday away at Worksop. Um, be a big crowd, usually a hostile crowd. Obviously, it's three G surface. Um, it, you know, just for my lads, it's it's a, it's a test of character. They've got you know they've got to, they've got to put this to bed quickly. Um, chuck it in the bin where it deserves because there's been nothing there's nothing positive to take out of it. Um, and, and, and go again and, and, and as I said you know we're capable of beating anybody on this day equally you know if we're not at it you know we can we can absolutely we can lose um, uh, games of football so like I said you know I don't think we need to have an easier reaction to this it is what it is we've lost a game of football uh, you, you know me well by now it, it, it hurts it, it's it's a bit of pill to swallow because you don't see it coming but um, but yeah, sometimes you just got to take it on the chin, um, chuck it in the bin where it belongs and, and, and try and move on and get a reaction. OK, thanks as always, Wayne. Um, obviously a tough day today, but uh, we go again Tuesday. Thank you.